seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> Keisha, you crazy mother. Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl, Keisha. I've been getting a lot of questions from ladies asking how to clean a beauty blender, and this is one that I have. I have a couple, actually, but this is the Beach Cosmetics Beauty Sponge, and I've had this for a while. If you guys want a review on this, then just comment down below. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to clean your beauty blender, or beauty blender too, okay? Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you like it, and click that big red button to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm very, you know, meticulous about cleaning this little spongy thing right here. This is what I use to clean my beauty blender, and is actually a solution that I made and I just put it in my Annabelle eye makeup remover bottle because it was empty and I put a label on it because well I have one of these for my eyes and honey you do not want to be putting this on your eye because well it has alcohol in it and that would not be pretty but I do love using this because it's a pump and it makes everything mess free and hassle free so that's why I love using it with this if you guys want to see how to make a beauty blender cleanser then just keep on watching <laughs> The first thing you're going to want to do is get a clean container with a pump. This is the one that I'm using from Annabelle. If you already have a makeup brush cleaner, then go right on ahead and pour a little bit into your container. You'll notice that I'm eyeballing how much of each product that I'm using just because it doesn't really matter, it's just how much you want. The next ingredient is some baby shampoo. This is one from the dollar store. I really like using baby shampoo for cleaning my utensils because it's very mild and gentle. The next ingredient is some dish soap. It doesn't really matter which one you use. This one is the Dawn Platinum one, but dish soap really helps to get rid of the oils that is built up in your beauty blender. The next ingredient is some 99% alcohol. You can find it at any dollar store, but this really helps to sanitize your beauty blender and get rid of all the bacteria. Once you've filled up your container about a third of the way with product, the last ingredient, of course, is water. Fill this all the way up to the top and shake well to mix all the products together. When you're all finished, your DIY beauty sponge cleaner should look something like this. Now that we're all done, let's put that bad boy to work. So I hope you guys like this little DIY video and I'll see you lovely ladies and gents in my next one. Bye. So I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe and I'll see you beautiful, lovely people in my next video. Bye.